Okay, hello guys and once again welcome back to the channel. If you're watching this video right now, you probably have the same problem I did a few days ago and your knock simulator is not working every time you try to open Laplace M using your computer or your laptop. Now, if you did try or if you haven't tried it yet, uh, let me just provide you with this additional info. I did remove the game from my emulator. I tried to re-download the game directly from Google Play. Unfortunately, it did not work. So I tried two more times. I tried re-downloading or downloading the game via APK Pure, but it did not work as well. And I downloaded the game using the APK files directly, but it wasn't working as well. My next option was to remove the game from my emulator and re-download it fresh. And as you can see, it's still not working and it's stuck before I can get into the login page. Now, I did find a solution a few days back or let's say about four days back on how I can actually play the game using my Nox emulator. And for today, I'm going to be teaching you the method I used in order to play the game especially if you have an old computer or an old laptop which is not in compatible mode with the game okay without further ado let me just show you how you can play the game okay the first thing you need to do would be to close the game and go back directly on the main web page or the main page of your Nox emulator once you're on the main platform of your Nox simulator, just click on settings, then click on advanced settings. You can copy the performance settings here or you can change it accordingly depending on your computer components or specs. But if you want, you can follow the ones I have. I am using 3 core and 2 gig of memory and Regarding the graphics rendering mode, this is where we need to make some changes. Uh, usually, Nox would be or would be using compatible OpenGL. This would be the uh, this would be the default mode of every Nox player once you've installed the game. So usually, you won't encounter any problems with this kind of settings. But if you're playing the a new type of game or the new the new re newly released games. As of now, then it might not work on your computer, especially if your computer is similar with mine, which is almost 8 to 10 years old. <laughs> it's pretty old and the specs are not really that compatible anymore, especially with the newer games. So all you have to do would, do, would be to select Speed Direct X option. Once you select that option, make sure to click on Save Settings and click on restart now okay after clicking restart the game would of course restart and we just need to wait for the game to load and we can try to open Laplace M once again okay one once it's done loading just click on the game and now we just have to wait okay there you go so it works so you can now start your adventure you can create your characters and you can start playing the game by the way on the main or on the opening screen you can actually create four characters or you have four character slots in order to start the game up okay anyway guys if this video did help you out please make sure to click on the like button and the subscribe and the bell notification button as well so you will be updated every time we upload a new video and once again thanks for watching and please continue in supporting our videos so we can grow into a larger community and once again thanks for gaming or thanks for watching